the problem of high commodity prices is much easier to deal with and it is not new. At the beginning of the NRM administration in 1986 and for the period 1972 to 1986, following the expulsion of the, of the Ugandan Indian entrepreneurs by Idi Amin, the recent phenomenon of high commodity prices is indeed a problem, but it is easier to solve than, for instance, COVID-19 was. COVID-19 needed severe restrictions and new science, e.g. vaccines. It was a new problem. It needed new uh, solutions and a lot of restrictions. The problem of the high prices, this one, would be solved with existing knowledge, but rightly applied. But because of the continued uncertainty, we are now going to move away from just depending on uh, sugar for tea, brown sugar, raw sugar. We are saying, okay, why don't we convert our sugar into petroleum? Because then the demand will be endless. And we had resolved on, on that, but recently some of our neighbors have started buying again. So similarly, these producers of, of uh, palm oil, I hear that, that they, are, they have started converting it into, into petroleum. Some of the ideas people think about when confronted with high commodity prices are the idea of subsidy. Government or removal of taxes by government from those commodities. With imported commodities, this is a recipe for disaster. It will lead to collapse of the economy. Download the app on App Store or Google Play Store now. Vision Digital Experience, the future of media.